Let's do this thing. Hello, we are back for another Favorite Things video. Every time we do these, you guys really like them, and it's been a while since we did the last one. I will link it below if you are curious to see our last... We've done maybe two or three, I can't remember, two. favorite things. And I was thinking that I have another idea. I want to do a favorite things of some of our kids, things that our kids have really liked. It, it might give you some gift ideas for Christmas because there's just a few things that the kids play with over and over and they were inexpensive and, you know, those are always the kind of things I was looking for. So be looking for that. But today we're doing another his and hers favorite thing. Um, actually, we laughed because I brought my things down in this, which is a pink sparkle bag, and he brought it in a, in a bucket. So that just kind of sums up what you're going to see today. You're going sure. to see some, like, you know, care, self-care things, some practical homeschooling things, and some sturdy gift things. idea, and then his stuff, too, you know. <laughs> okay, well, let's get started. Okay. Do you want to start? You want me to start? No, go ahead. Okay. Oh, this is so exciting. Okay, first of all, on our last Favorite Things video, we talked about charcoal. We were so into this activated charcoal. Oh, toothpaste? No, we didn't know about that then. Don't give I mean, my secret I, away. I you... Okay. Oh, man, this has gone bad already. <laughs> we talked about activated charcoal last time, how we, like, used it for all kinds of things. We used it to clean our teeth, even though it was a total mess. Mm -hmm. And we saved our dog's life with it. It was like this big thing. <laughs> but we, charcoal has gone to the next level for us because we have discovered there is such a thing as charcoal toothpaste. Toothpaste, guys, this is great. It's pretty good. It is. The whole family, well, the littlest ones still want their like strawberry flavored toothpaste. That they eat. <laughs> I did see them licking it last night. Yeah. But for yeah. the rest of us, we are sold. We actually bought a four pack. I had bought one to try, and then we mm -hmm. went back and bought a four pack because I have little zipper pouches. Yeah, that's another video. It is. Everybody has their own toothbrush kit. But anyway, it really is black, so don't be surprised, okay? Because when you squeeze it out, black is going to come out. And gray comes. It won't, yeah. Oh, yeah. So it looks disgusting in the moment, but it won't stain your sink. It rinses right off, and it really does freshen and whiten your teeth so exciting and it was cheap too we got it on amazon and it was really cheap so that's my first um all of our everything we talk about i will put a link for in the description box so look right under this video for a link to everything okay, are interesting. yes um hey, do we want to bounce back and forth yeah go ahead share something otherwise right. i'll just hog it all hmm i'll start with probably a thing that used to stress me out quite a bit um, so when we, my kids would get toys for birthdays or whatever, and if they were battery powered, double uh, A, triple A, you know, it seemed none of them were ever really rechargeable where you could plug them in and do it. And it just flipped me out that we'd sit there and and spend that much money. Yeah. And then we'd go through a lot of batteries. We would. And I kept telling her buy a rechargeable, and she's like, I don't want to mess with it. I don't want to hassle with it. So what we did is we found um, some that we like. So the brand is EVL, okay? These are AA and they're 2300 milliamps, uh, meaning that they are pretty powerful for rechargeable batteries. They do really well even in our um, high draining uh, toys slash cameras slash whatever. And initially I had a multi-charger that um, did more than just double AA, A, triple A. Um, it would do uh, some other batteries, and I'm kind of bleeding into the next thing here. So we, I had bought a flashlight, and I'll, I'll get into the charger here in a second. But I want to talk about this. I bought a flashlight, and it is pretty powerful. And um, we live out in the country, and it gets really dark at night. So right, the no street lights, are whatever. Important to us. Exactly. You find, you know, you need to go find something or whatever. And so this one, you know, zooms in, and it's it was just it's a basically one that had been rebranded. And is this from Amazon? It is. Okay. Yeah. And um, I actually saw uh, some friends of ours, our only friend Joe, um, has two of these. Uh, his boys had gotten them. You know, same idea. And they come with this AAA insert, battery insert that goes in there, and um, and it, and it's fairly bright. But then also you have the ability of putting in a rechargeable lithium ion battery and so um, this is a little bit larger so again here's a double A. Where'd you get that? This is a battery from an old drill 
that went bad. A battery battery a battery so, pack that so went bad. So you can't buy those? You can. You invented this. No, you no, can't. You can, but why? When, when <laughs> so Because not everybody's MacGyver like you. Okay. Well, old laptop batteries, the older ones or the fatter ones, if you will, same things. Okay. But how do you charge this? This whole thing With is boggling my With the battery mind. charger that we now have lost somewhere on our property. Where it's at, I don't know. This is terrible. We, this it is, is terrible it start is. to our favorite I know. video. But, but can they buy the battery charger? Of course, What's the yeah. Story? But they can't buy ours because we can't find it. So the idea is that it had a digital readout on the screen and it let you know um, if it was charging where it was at in the charge, meaning like how much longer it had to go, which and was really, really And it could really, do the really double helpful. A's or the triple double A's. Double A, triple anything. A, and these, what, these yeah, are called yeah. 18650s. Did I write that? Yeah, 18650s. And so the idea, again, is that you can buy these, um, and um, Grandpa Winkler has given one of these that he bought to Bella for her flashlight, which is essentially the same thing. Anyway, my idea, the, the idea is that these are wonderful little flashlights that have been there for a while and have been pretty bulletproof and um, the idea that you can use triple A's with that little insert, the little plastic insert or these or um, these large cells, yeah because these large cell batteries last a very very long time and so um, getting into the back into the charger well we couldn't we had so many different batteries and, and I was cheap because I wasn't sure that I liked that charger that I bought initially with the display that I bought um, one that can charge a bunch now. Okay. And this is what we use regularly. This is what we use now, but it won't charge my 18650s. Right. But for your average Joe, this is going to be great. Well, and not, we leave But we this... don't have average Joe watch. <laughs> There's some of them. Maybe. We leave this set up all the time. We have a system so that the kids know because the rechargeable batteries, if your kids throw them away or don't charge them, are no good. So we just have right. a little container saying these are already charged and we have another bucket. That looks different. If, if they're dead, it's, they throw it in the bucket. Right. It's like an old uh, peanut or like cashew you container. You can taste whatever you want. Right, but I'm just saying like different shapes so that the toddlers get it. This is not the whatever. Right, right. You have to charge two of the same as at a time, so that's like a little. So two triple A's in the right. same bank. There's that's and it. and you so the thing I don't two. like about this is that it is four banks and you have to have two of the same, which is really not a big deal yeah, it until it comes down to you have one triple A and one double A. Right. You need to charge them and you don't have another one to charge. Then you got to wait for for another one. So anyway, the other the other one would just do whatever. And so this this is if you will. This is a Chevy or a Honda, whatever, and the other one's like an Acura or a Cadillac, okay, which I liked. I don't know. I Mercedes, think it's great. whatever you want to say. I think it's great. So, Buy it. So that Buy was great. So Change again, your life with rechargeable batteries. It, yeah, 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 yeah. And so, again, kind of on that same vein. Are you doing like three things here? You're maybe. kind of being a little hoggy. It all relates. You want to break it up? It's gone. No, go oh, ahead. Right. Go ahead. Go ahead. So your what I have here, what I have here was a Christmas gift I got two Christmas ago. I guess going on three. I don't know. Um, and it is a light that has three settings. Oh wow! Look at it bounce. You can work on your car. You, you can. Look can. At small and spaces. so the thing that I like about it is it's a USB plug-in that just goes in your USB oh. charger. Don't touch the light, please. And I so, wonder um, if if. We could find this yes. where they got that. I've already bought one for somebody else. Oh, yeah, okay. So they, all right. They right. don't make them in just yellow. Right. But that was the color I was. Because getting. this would be a I great like Christmas them. gift for a guy. It is actually. So like you're doing anything, um, and you're you know it's cold out. So I, you know like when it starts getting warmer, I'm kind of like sad because now I gotta go get whatever. Um, and what I do is just when it starts getting dim, I start throwing it in. I'll throw it in my car charger. I'll throw it in the house charger. So it just plugs in. Yeah, and it goes green whenever That's it's charged. Cool. It's, Was it this is expensive? Really cool. No, it's really reasonable. Hmm. And the quality of the, the hat itself is, is really, really good. And it washes up. So you just pop this thing out. Right, you can throw, throw it in the washer. Throw it in the washer and you're good to go. And so you don't always have yeah. to look like a minion. <laughs> uh, <laughs> if they didn't buy yellow, that would help. <laughs> right. But yeah, this has been... You, he misplaced his hat last week, and he's like, where's my hat? Where's Where my hat? Is my Every hat? Day, where's my hat? It's yeah, because it yeah. was cold enough to use it. it. Now, hold on. Of, of While life. we're talking about that. You are kidding it's me. Like, it's a flashlight. It's not fair. I need to go find something girly just to make up for all this. I, all right, go ahead. That's right. fine. This is your last. So, cut off. This, is, uh, this is a headlight that I was given by my dad, um, and it is great because it, it, you can do a single um, you can then do just the two outsides, or you can do all three. 
and um, it's really bright and the beautiful thing about it is is that it runs off of two batteries and two of those 18650s okay if you get serious about the rechargeable batteries and you want to have you don't want to have to sit there and recharge batteries every day these 18650s are the answer they really are okay i don't get any commission off of selling types of batteries over another you need to do a man video just about batteries because you could probably talk a week i could do i get a turn now um so anyway the thing the other thing that i like about this specific design <laughs> is that i can run two batteries or one and the two just extends how long the light will question stay. yes what if they don't have these super weird batteries you can buy them on amazon I mean, that's the only thing this light For takes. this one, no. You could take those silly inserts, the AAA. It's like and a, it's the same it's idea. a casing that three... Right. So the lithium-ion batteries, and that's what these big ones are, okay? They're 3.47 volts or something like that, okay? And basically, if you start adding up the AAA batteries, it's 1.5 or 1.2 if they're rechargeable. You add them up together, and it's close enough within tolerance there. And so things will operate and work just as if they're the same thing. Okay, I'm done. My turn? You want me to keep going? No, that's okay. Okay, okay you're doing a great, great job on all your battery sales there. Thank you. Um, okay, I'm gonna do like two since you did like 17. I did. Okay, so. first of all, I wash a lot of dishes because I'm the official dishwasher in the house. This is a really cheap, life-changing thing. But it's, um, yeah, if you don't have one of these, you need to go get one immediately because this will make pan washing so easy. Wait, you're the pan washer in the family now? Great I'm always news. the pan washer. Once in a while, you. Always. I mean. <clears throat> Once in a while. I, I'm the designated. Does anybody else see a fallacy in this, these statements? Here? <laughs> I'm the designated, and then you come and bless me. Okay. And I'm like, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so when Jason washes the pans, <laughs> this is what you need. And I bought, I think it's a six pack for $5 or something like that from Amazon. Love these things. So, in, in all fairness, the, um, the, the really nice ones from the... Oh yeah, Norwex lady Norwex, sent me one. Yes, those that last was nice. longer, but, but, a little better. Yeah, but mine did fall apart. That's why I Oh sure, these. right. Yeah. They're not bulletproof. No, yeah. no, but that was nice. Okay, another thing for my kitchen is, um, I've talked about this in separate videos, but this is a huge magnet, this thing right here. Um, you can use this to write meal plans on. Um, another homeschooling mom I know, um, she uses it to write like what they're doing each day of the week, whatever you want. It's just a weekly calendar that's a huge magnet. And I noticed it's on sale right now for $9 from, or $9.90 or something like that on Arteza. So I will put a link for that. It's normally only, I think, 13 something. So it's not like a huge difference, but I noticed that it's on sale right now. So I have this on the refrigerator. However, I was trying to write on it with regular dry erase markers and every time somebody would go by, if they touched it at all, it would smudge off what I had written and that was frustrating. So I found these on Amazon and they are wonderful. They are wet erase markers. They wipe off easily with a wet rag, so at the end of the week, you can just take a wet rag and wipe it off, no big deal. Um, and they make writing on this so easy because they are fine tips. So you have the colors, but they're very, um, can you see that? Yeah, they're very fine tip. You can pick whatever size you want. I just wanted fine tips so I could fit a lot on there. Um, I think that was maybe like $8 for a set of four, so they probably really like, you know, $2 a piece. There were a lot of varieties. I'll just link this one. And then um, pick whatever you want, but yeah, I I recommend that. It was it's it's a winner. Do you want to turn, Jason, yes. before I go continue yes. in my bag? Yeah, I was thinking about sharing that too, actually. Okay. I pull that out. So this is a blanket. No, it's not. No, it's not a blanket. We went on a hammock kick this year. We did. We just. It started out that um, I noticed through Money Saving Mom that hammocks are on sale at, on Amazon. So that's where this all began. I don't know if it's just because of COVID that it was like one hammock sale after another. It was crazy. The first one I think we got for like $8. It was on sale so cheap. And I almost didn't get it. No, the first one was my Father's Day gift and it was not cheap. It was not, it was not cheap. Okay, so... You need but to keep nice. watching Amazon. Even full price, these aren't expensive, but they just keep doing hammock sales. And right. they are wonderful. I'm sorry, this, this is was a your two item, person. wasn't it? It was. 
it's great. Whenever I was really sick, if you did, if you saw that video, I was really sick for like five days, very, very sick. And I would just lay in this and it was so wonderful. And I think, I think full price, I, I looked up full price. These two men are $17 on Amazon. They're two person. Two, yeah, two, two men. <laughs> That's what they call it. That is really dumb. <laughs> or four kid, four but kid. <laughs> seriously though, we pack the kids in and it seems to hold up really yes. well. So, so there, we, we have a couple different ones that we got. The, in, the initial one that we had um, has, this is, has like a strap, almost like a ratchet strap type or backpack strap uh, material in here. And it, it goes through the threading itself up there and then chokes itself off if you guys, or chokes through. If you understand how to tie things off, you'll understand what I'm talking about. If you don't understand, probably doesn't matter what I'm saying right no, now. No, because I have, I didn't even like notice the end of it. I just laid right. in it and it felt good. But for those that do care, mm -hmm. this is for you. <laughs> this is a carabiner of steel. So it's painted, okay, it's not aluminum. This is uh, load, duty. yeah, it's load worthy, if you will. And this is uh, easier, if you will, to try to connect then to any tree combination or whatever it is that you're trying to hook up. The other ones that we had had, had ropes and you had to kind of mm -hmm. know what you were doing. It's not as much fun. So we have like various um, pieces of chain that we had been, that I've been kind of saving up in the stockpile. I'm a little bit of a hoarder when it comes to certain items. Um, but it's really been very nice for the yeah. kids when they go to, I'm looking at them, they're shaking their heads. Um, when they go to hang the hammocks a lot easier because then I don't have to help. Yeah. It's just click. I know it's safe. They're out there and they're doing it and it's good to go. This would be another really good gift idea actually for somebody that it you really don't know is. what to get them. A two, definitely and get there's a two many person colors. One. Many colors. There's no reason to get them a single unless they're really yeah, a small the two, person. Yeah. The two person is really just big and cozy and wonderful. Yeah. There's no and reason why it's, yeah. And there's no reason yeah. why it would be awkward or not appropriate for a single person because then they I can agree. throw blankets in there, books. Whatever. Yeah, I'm sold. Yep. We, I think we own four now. Are we up to four? We are up to four. Plus our other hammocks? Yes. Yeah. No. Three. That's how much we like them. Four. Okay. I think it's four. Okay, so we, speaking of gifts. Well, and we want more. So if you're looking for Christmas gift ideas. <laughs> Buy us more hammocks. No, seriously though. The link is below. Here, no. Here's one of the ideas that, that um, when we were building our cabin out here, um, the office slash cabin, you know, the one of the things that we like to offer people is to be able to come out here and rest and so the idea of having hammocks throughout our property um, on our porch out here out in the woods you know in, in places where people would go like that is a desirable thing mm -hmm. and so um, it's if you will it's kind of like a tool for us as well that's where we are right now if you're curious about this strange background we're in the half finished cabin, cabin. Okay, so moving on to another gift idea. Three quarter finish. If you want to, especially if you're looking for a unique gift and you want to support a real person, this is our friend. <laughs> not fake people. <laughs> not well, robots. This is like a lifelong friend who's a homeschooling dad of four, and he has started woodworking, and he is making tea light artwork. Artwork, mm -hmm. right? He has an Etsy shop mm -hmm. that I will put a link for. We have a large piece of his that's in our windowsill right now. And then we have this one, which would be a really sweet gift for someone. So he goes and cuts the trees down himself and then um, like... Drills out. Yeah. He has a variety of things. There are large pieces, like for a whole, you know, table, centerpiece, huge yeah. centerpiece to smaller pieces. There's just lots of variety. Yep. And... Cedar. He's super sweet. He would just Deadwood, be tickled. Driftwood tickled if you guys would go buy things for yeah and then leave comment or something just let yeah. him know and he's just very excited about this new endeavor he's and really, we are loving he's got his an stuff eye for he does yeah. it's really cool yeah for bella's birthday he actually carved her out of a wood um a piece of wood he carved her this relief of an owl now i wasn't going to show it because i don't he doesn't have those for sale yet that's just something that he carved for her but it was beautiful maybe he he'll, should maybe he'll start You're yeah. watching robbie right maybe he'll start Okay, um, do you have something? I do. You want to go into something? Okay, so... I have to share, bef you know, I can't forget to share about my super awesome contact deal, but... Go for it. No, no, no. No, go you said you, it. You water bottle, water no, bottle. This go is, for This it. was a winner no. for me, too. Okay, all right. So, you sure? I really want you to do yours. I, I don't want to be a hog. How many more things do you have? I don't want to be a hog. I have, um, 
I only have one more thing, actually. I need to go then. Yeah. Okay. Counting the contacts? Mm-hmm. The contacts is my last thing. Oh. Well, maybe See I'll give you some of my things. You want to talk about this? <laughs> I will. All right. Um, we are water bottle people, and Jason had this nice stainless steel water bottle. Tree tried. Uh-huh. But it was just a huge opening, and everybody would dump it all over themselves when they drank. I have a big enough big mouth to handle the thing. It actually, it was really well, because if I'm thirsty and I want to take in a lot of water, and I know what I'm doing, I can drink it and not spill it on myself. Well, the other nine people in the family struggled, so we'll go with that 90% of the population who struggled. Um, so he bought... Where'd you find this? This is Sportslet on, well, so you could go on True Tribe's website or you can go on Amazon, depending okay. on who you want to sponsor. Okay. Yeah. So, I think it's the same money, it's the same yeah, thing. It's yeah, it's the same. $10. It was really, $10. really nice. Yeah. This is um, really great. So it is a sports top, is that what they call it? Yeah. And it just fits right on this and it's wonderful. Yep. And it vents and so. You it, can even drink laying down because when you're tired and pregnant in the middle of the night and you feel like, so thirsty you can drink without um, That's a true story so in that sense it's nice it, you yeah. can't get the volume or the the gallons per minute that that I prefer I, yeah. but it works well so then basically when she was down and out for five days that was my water bottle I just lost it yeah I kind of took over she did so then yeah, thank you right so then I went down to a smaller so that's a one liter size bottle I again I'm like, we got to bring a lot. That was my water bottle that I had before. Are you just bringing this one to show off your skills? Is this really a favorite thing item to it, share, it, or is it? It like, is. It is because so right awesome. now this is my favorite water bottle. Why? If you would just wait, <laughs> you okay. would hear. Okay. So this is a 750 milliliter, which is roughly 25 ounces. Okay, so they're, they're probably going to market it as 24 ounces, but. Um, and it, uh, you know, I'll, I'll get a link or something very, very close. Again, these are uh, vacuum sealed, so they're double lined, which helps keep the water in there either cool or warm, depending on what we want. So you can leave it in the car in the sun, and it won't change the temperature of the water. That was really important to me because I, I really don't like drinking warm water when I want cold water or whatever. And we have well water, so it gets pretty cold out of the tap. So anyway, she's she's like, hurry up. So, um, no, I'm actually not, I wasn't even going to talk about the paint at all. Oh. Well, it was black, and it was all scratched up. So then I took it to my wire wheel and just, you know, made it look acceptable because I was taking this to work, and as some of you may know. <laughs> this could be your new side job. Of making Send nasty water bottles. Send me your ugly scratched water bottles, and I will make them shiny stainless yeah, steel. Yeah, right. Anyway, uh, can you see? There's so what do you love about it, There's a little bit of black, right? Yeah. Black. Okay, <clears throat> still. Um, what do I like about it? Um, it's a good size. Again, it has a nice size mouth. Like again, yeah, if I want to take, a reasonable one. it is. It really it doesn't need to be bigger no. than this. She's right, except for when it comes to cleaning. Okay, so I guess what I would do, we we should probably we need to get one ourselves. Get a good water bottle cleaner. Cleaning. Yeah. We have one that works. Yeah, it's, it's not good. If you have one that you love, good. will you Please put the link for us, us in the? Comments. Yeah, it's got to be sturdy and like easily cleanable and then being able to get, you know, our uh -huh. one gallon water bottle because I <laughs> I, I sweet talk our uh, our uh, five-year-old um, into cleaning the inside of my one gallon because he can fit his whole hand in there right. and scrub around. I can't get in there. This will be next month's will be the right. best water cleaning brush there on the planet. There we go. There we go. We'll so this is really good because it actually fits in my, like my back pocket in an emergency where I'm, I'm needing two hands and I'm holding it. Um, that one had a carabiner clip that I could clip it on things. That was really cool. The, the original thing had a metal uh, lid so it was a little bit more durable. That one, I don't know I, if I'd trust it very long on a, on a carabiner clip, but that was that. Um, go ahead and give us your contact. Oh, you know what? Yeah. I just thought of another favorite thing that I had wanted to tell them about okay. last month. It's not something to show, but we had told you guys about Jordan Michael Tuesday's YouTube channel. Um, and a lot of you have gone there and just fallen in love with them and supported them. But what I wanted to tell you is that he has a brother who also oh, yeah. has a YouTube channel, and I don't Carl. think a lot of people connect the dots mm -hmm. or know about them. His name is Carl Gessler, mm -hmm. and he also is just, they're just this precious Christian family who just, that's what they do, is just share about Jesus. They travel around. They're musicians, yep. so they have um, CDs. Do they have CDs? The, you he can does, print. yes. Actually, you buy. can get it on iTunes. We should buy that.
Jordan's DVD. Well, I had downloaded it. Does that count? Yeah. So oh, you just we have the, it. We have it on. Yeah, the, with our cell phone packages, yeah, yeah. we have automatic. We get. Right, music. Mm -hmm. So I will put a link to their channel because that's another one that I I couldn't believe I didn't um, I didn't mention that when we mentioned Jordan. Right. So. One of the things I like about their channel is that they have this. Um, oh man, I should know his name. They have this firefighter that comes on it and uh, a it's real a puppet. Human? No, it's a puppet. Oh, the puppet guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really like yeah. it. It's kind of They're fun. Silly it's goofy, fun. but I like it's it. It's family entertainment that it you is. can all sit down together as a family and laugh yep. and be encouraged. And you don't feel like you go really scrub your brain afterwards. Really, really precious people. I just makes me want to meet the rest of their family because I think they have a lot of siblings. Right. Okay, so my contact deal. So if you notice, some of you have commented because you're really observant that after wearing contact or glasses for a long time, I started wearing contacts again. Well, it was because of being frugal that I was wearing glasses for so long, even though my glasses are in bad shape. But here in the States, you cannot just go even my prescription has not changed in so long. I've just worn the same things out of the same prescription for years. And yet you have to have a, a contacts, a contacts eye exam every single year it expires or you can't get more contacts and it was a hundred dollars for me to go and just get the exam and then i'd have to buy the contacts and i was so frustrated that i just kept wearing glasses well my friend hold on probably for a good reason yes so, i'm sure it's care. for a good reason but i'm at the point that my prescription doesn't change and i don't want to go every single year and spend hundred dollars on a contact eye exam so anyway my friend <laughs> she was the first guinea pig that she um, found out that in the UK you can just order contacts they actually say on their website we trust that you know what's best for your eyes so just let us know what your prescription is and we will mail you um, some contacts so she did it first she was the guinea pig I went ahead and did it next. It's my same contact brand that I have here. I wrote left on it because I write left and right, so I know what I'm doing. In big letters. <laughs> I don't know. It's my same contact brand. I only bought, um, the th I just wanted to try it out. So this is just a box of three, but you can get whatever you want. Um, and it came to, I wrote this down, because you pay in pounds, because it's, you know, obviously not the US. Um, but PayPal, I paid through PayPal, and they automatically convert it to English dollars and so for six contact lenses including the shipping which I think was 10 pounds of shipping I said English that's what I meant okay. <laughs> write me all your hate criticism in the comments below no actually we never get that I don't know where all the hateful people are because they don't watch our channel we just get nice comments all the time okay Thank you. Um, so it came to 55 US dollars including the shipping for six contact lenses. Wait, so each all together. Six sets. Six no, that would be three three sets. Sets. Okay. Three sets of left and right. Okay. Came to so that's like three months, but I wear them a little longer than I'm supposed to. I, I hope no eye doctors are watching this because I am like breaking all the rules. But I do wear them a little bit longer. Or rule um, breakers. Maybe like a week longer. It's, a, it's just, you know, don't arrest me. So it's probably four months worth for me for $55. Pretty good. And no eye exam fee, and I was just really excited. Oh, and my contacts are even more expensive because I have a really bad astigmatism. Is that what they call it? Astigmatism. Yeah, right, which, you know, makes my contacts more expensive. So you, yours might even be cheaper than that. But that was mine. Carry on, okay. Mr. Bowditch. I don't like that book. <laughs> this is not a book video. Just carry on. What do you still have to share with us? Um, I have a hat. Oh yeah, that's a great hat. So the oh, I can't remember that, that. we got that from Amazon. PFG. Yeah. So this is a Columbia. Columbia. Yeah. So I I I did a search to find out. Um, I really liked the straw hat look. I thought it was really fun. It was cool, meaning. Um, when the temperature was hot, you know, the sun was on you, yeah. it keeps this, I, I have a, uh, I'm half redneck, so the, uh, that's actually, it's true, but okay, anyway, okay. moving on. The, I don't do well in the sun and my neck right, gets right. really sunburned and whatnot, so it keeps it off my face as well. Um, but last year we bought your real straw hat and it fell apart. Right, they don't last long at yeah. all. So yeah. um, I did some research, best hats available, 
and there was some really nice ones for a lot of money. This one was reasonable, uh, mm -hmm. under fifty dollars, and um, it's super durable. And They're it talking looks about as being good able a shape to, as yeah, you can crunch it, it yeah, up, and it's amazing. And, uh, I mean, it's getting dirty, right? Um, I got it. It's got that little thing right there. I like that little. She thing. says it makes me That's look stylish. dapper. Yeah. Dapper. <laughs> <laughs> I like being called. I don't get that very often. Just my wife. Um, so yeah, so that was one of mine. Um, but then I want to move on to some tools. Uh, yeah, so this is something that we recently came into. So we have, uh, we were, I was given this driver. It's a little 12 volt Bosch driver and it has lithium ion batteries down here. And um, didn't have a charger, didn't have the battery. Uh, the, the gentleman who gave it to us is a good family friend, um, like a second parent, and um, just had an extra one. He says, here, here you go, I don't need it. Um, so I just kept waiting for the opportunity to find an, a charger and batteries or whatever. And then I found this on Craigslist, actually. This with two batteries and a charger, uh, but it rates it at a, a lesser voltage, 10.8. Uh, instead of the 12, I was like, oh no, it's the wrong one. And they're like, no, it's marketing. So the peak, it is at 12, but normally it really is 10.8. And so they want to say, everybody else is saying 12, so we're going to say 12 too. So anyway, long story short, what I like about these is there's a lot of power. This is made well, and um, Bosch is not the only one that I would choose if I were to go out and buy these brand new. Um, but what I like about them is that they are, uh, there's a lot of power and not a lot of weight. So kids so, can help you. Yeah, exactly. So when I was hanging drywall at... Um, at the project that was working on, um, I was able to have the kids hold this, and you know I'm doing it over my head, and because I have corporal tunnel issues, it wasn't aggravating that anymore. Because I have some really nice screw guns, otherwise, but uh, really pretty high in weight. So um, this one is just a, a regular screw, and this one is an impact, um, and they have little lights on them, which is really neat because it helps out for these old eyes. Um, Anyway, so just really cool. I'll link that uh, in the description. And again, the, if you stick with brand names like uh, Ryobi, Makita, DeWalt, um, Milwaukee, uh, you're not going to go wrong on uh, these little drivers. They make really, really good products. This is not the only one. This happens to be the one I like and have. So that's that. Um, while we're talking about... I should have just kept going on the batteries here. So, you have more batteries. I do have more batteries, although I can't I should find title this Jason's Favorite Batteries. Jason's Favorite Batteries. Where did the little small battery, battery go? Oh, there it is. So, um, these two batteries are for Riley. So, the same gentleman who gave us uh, gave us the, uh, the little Bosch driver also gave me a bunch of Ryobi tools. And I was like, oh, okay, that's great. And at the time, we really were kind of low on funds. And I had a screw gun that was working. So I was trying to be in, you know, intentional with our money. And then uh, for Christmas, I um, asked or requested for some batteries and a charger, um, which I got. And so that kind of leads us into this because um, I figured, okay, there's a lot of tools there. It's going to be beneficial for us for future projects. So I got the cheapest... 2.5 amp hours and if you know anything about batteries this is kind of this matters a lot and so I got the cheapest one out there um, and the charger Silas is going to bring to me um, wow. thank you thank you Vanna so uh, this <laughs> one charges any from 12 to 18 volts the the regular Ryobi brand does just the same so if you have any it's the same kind of thing but I want to make a like a buyer beware type thing here um, so after Did you having say a Barbie? These, no. Buyer beware. Oh, buyer beware. Sorry. <laughs> Go on. Go on. Here's a 3 amp hour Ryobi brand battery. This is supposed to be 2.5. If you felt the weight, it's not 0.5 uh, amp hour difference. It's a tremendous weight difference. This is really light. And I actually like that for different reasons, but it would not hold the charge or do what I needed it to do very long. I'd have to charge them very, very quickly or uh, often. And thankfully, they charge pretty quickly because there's not a whole lot of power there. But here's where certain batteries, when you go to buy them for drills or whatever, unless it's a reputable um, brand, uh, 
just because it has high ratings and um, lots being sold doesn't mean that it makes it a good product. And so I actually then, you know, got the one that has the indicators on there. These did too, so I sprung a little bit more. That is helpful. Um, but again, this thing is worth its weight. It is, it, it costs maybe three times more of this, but if you only have one battery, this is going to last way, way, way longer than this. Way more than three times as much in, in a single charge. So this, the battery thing really, really matters, okay? And for, you know, you can kind of, you can probably fast forward to the end if you don't want to hear any more about tools. But, um, this had been, this is actually one that we just recently got. I gave the blue version that I had for 13 years, and it was the only screw gun I had. Uh, it was a quick, quick release, so that was um, good for most things, not good for drilling necessarily, because you couldn't just chuck a drill bit in there. Um, but it was really, really good, uh, and it, it, it held up so, so very well. And it comes with this clip that sl slides on there. My beautiful daughter Bella now has mine. Um, but this is Grandpa's that he gave me, and so now we have another battery in the family, if you will. That's really awesome. Um, and to go along was that with... that screw gun? That was a impact gun. So there's a difference between screw guns and impacts. Maybe we can explain that a little so bit. So if they were, if they had to pick one of these to buy their, a man in their life, or a woman in their life, or... Someone in their Christmas, life. If they had to pick one of those to buy for Christmas... Just to say, yep. I just want to be a general handy person. Okay, well, hold on. I'll just what? give you. I'll give you the quick rundown. No, no, no. Just no, pick no, one. No, I can't. What's the one I can't, I can't. that you no, would have them no, buy? Because, because I'd be lying. They're like me, Here's and they the don't know what to buy. Okay. Do you need to? Do you need to do something just around the house, hanging stuff, assembling things? This is your choice right All here. Right. All right. Okay. Cheaper. That's me. That's yeah. all I'm going to do. All right. This, this is actually, when we get a bigger house, it will stay at ho in the house, right? Um, this is the budget. I'll get it all done. It's going to be powerful enough to get it done, and it's awesome, okay? Um, um, actually, and it lasts a long time. This is the same, does, performs the same thing. Uh, it has a magnet on it. It's really cool, and it's cheaper than the Makita's. Wait, so this one's less expensive and more powerful? It is. Okay, see, winner! Kinda. It may not last as long as this one. Mm, okay. Okay, because these are really, really well built. But if they're looking for their big bang for their buck of someone opening a Worth present your money. and saying, oh, Worth your money. then Worth you your would money. get that one. I would. I would. Okay. Because right. what I did is I, f I was looking for, uh, my oldest son was looking for a gun for him because I wanted all six to myself. <laughs> <laughs> Well, actually, it started one of those things where if I gave him one, then I had to give somebody else one, so I didn't really want to get into that one. So then um, I saw a, the blue, Ryobi used to be blue, okay? I saw a kit here, I should take this off while I put my hand on the blade. Um, I saw a kit where it was the older style, and this is a five and a half inch circular saw, 18 volt, right? This came with lead acid batteries, and so they would really suck the batteries pretty quick, and, and it wasn't really all that awesome. The thing I like about this is that with these really nice batteries, this will last me most of the day on a project. Um, and if I have two of these, all day long, no problem, no matter what I'm throwing at it. Uh, now, mind you, the this, this smaller blade will only cut a 2x4 thick. Like, if you have anything bigger than a 2x4, you won't be able to cut it. So that's an inch and a half down here, okay? Um, they make larger ones, uh, 6 and a quarter, 6 and a half, something like that, and then 7 and a half. Um, if I were to do it over again and I were buying it brand new, I would probably buy the seven and a half inch one because that's the same size as a regular plug-in circular saw that's pretty standard. Um, and that way I can use the blades interchangeably because this is the only thing that runs this kind of battery, or excuse me, blade size. And so I'm kind of particular about that. I don't really like locking in to things where I now have to buy a special for that one thing. And so anyway. Uh, this has just been tremendous. Working out here, having 400 feet worth of extension cord uh, can burn up tools that way. So if you get in a position where you have a remote project, this is great. And it actually cuts down little saplings really good too. <laughs> you can tell that your life for a couple months now has just been all about building. Well, balancing that and, tools. and yeah. work, yeah. Right. right, but I mean, it's just been so in the forefront. Heavy, heavy focus on that, yeah. All right, well... Sure. Um, 
yeah that's it i think that's all we have be on the lookout for my kids gift idea video um and then that's it you have something else to say we'll see you next time Bye. Bye.